The ending of The Bad Batch has still left so many questions unanswered, like what happened with the rest of the Empire's cloning program? We know that Emperor Palpatine has some other plans for cloning beyond what happened in The Bad Batch, and potentially beyond what was happening on Mount Tantus. Did he have a failsafe for the destruction of this facility? Does he have backups of the research and data that was collected on Mount Tantus? Because we know, of course, the Emperor eventually clones himself. He becomes what he is in The Rise of Skywalker. We know that Snoke was a clone. And then there's also the question of Grogu, Baby Yoda, and some of the hints of the cloning program we've had in The Mandalorian. There's still so much mystery surrounding all of this kind of cloning, and it seems that no one is really willing to clear it up. No Star Wars series is yet willing to go there and to tie up some of these loose ends, which can mean one of two things. Either Disney and the writers haven't actually thought of what they want to do with the cloning side of Star Wars yet and haven't thought up an ending for this, or they have some grand plan for where cloning is going in the Star Wars galaxy and for Grogu's fate, for Grogu's backstory, and for how Palpatine did indeed return. Overall, I just hope they don't do what they did with the sequels and not have any plan at all. As Daisy Ridley revealed in an interview, they didn't actually know who Rey was. Uh, Palpatine's granddaddy and I was like, awesome. And then two weeks later, he was like, oh, we're not sure. So it kept... Changing. What do you think is going to happen with the Empire's cloning program? And do you think Disney and Lucasfilm are actually going to resolve this at some point?